This is our great experiment. It's felt covered in latex. In the latex. We hope it will float. Exactly. Will it float? It's already late, and it it does float. It seems. So very well, we have a success. Ah. Wow. It's the greatest joy on earth. We have a curach. Indeed. Can you see the string? Yes. Is it a problem? Not at all. And now when you step inside, does it hold you? When I put my foot. How does it feel? It's a kurach for rabbits. <laughs> or for rats. <laughs> Did you get that? Do it again. But don't spoil it. <laughs> spoil what? Don't break it? Don't. Uh, don't yeah, I don't know. <laughs> spoil the camera or what? Uh, uh, I don't know. I'm, I'm scared? Yeah. That it will sink? Yeah. Okay, throw. Wow, I got that. It's, it's on video for posterity now. For what? For posterity, which is the people who are unlucky to inherit the planet from us.
Completely out of this world. Do you still have the thread? Uh -huh. In your foot. Your foot is in the picture. Do you move it over it? I wonder if we could make very big ones for two or three people to hang out inside and then they could all be tied together like a patchwork of islands. I was sure it wouldn't wouldn't float. I was sure it would get flat. Mm. But the rubber does have some good holding qualities. Yeah. So if I imagine if there are people inside that would be really uh they they would need to shape and they would need to hold the shape. The people would hold the shape. Yeah. They would need to make themselves round. So if there are two people, they can make quite a perfect dish. Well, because the bottom of it is a bit pushed up by the weight of the water mm -hmm. or the pressure. But actually humans then would push this down and what we only need is a tall enough shape that the boat would not sink from the pressure. Yeah, and not too tall so that it doesn't topple. Yeah. I think this geometry is quite fine. Mm. Not very aerodynamic. <laughs> Hygrodynamic. Maybe we could also paint it like turtle shells. We could paint these Turin patterns on the outside when the latex is still wet. Ah. 
<laughs> with different colored, we can make two uh, two latex mix. We could make it with pigments. Mm. Transparent and white. Mm -hmm. But depends what. Yeah, we should have some parts transparent for the felt to shine through. Actually, this latex did not become transparent. It will. It will in time. Yeah, only the very outer layer of the latex is dried. Most of the latex is still wet, actually, oh. in this specimen. Oh. Amen. Probably it's currently dissolving in the water. <laughs> okay, maybe we take it out. Oh, oh we can see how, how long it remains. We can also lock it here and look if it's there still tomorrow. <laughs> we could just hang it for the night, like it gets to um, get comfortable in its environment, get to know its environment. You are a water creature. You come from water. It'd be very easy for people to carry them on their bicycle, these boats. Exactly, because they can use them as clothes. Mm. And then they would arrive and unpack their boat. They would just fall backwards into the river. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or including the bicycle, <laughs> like the the wheels into the sky and the back into the river. <laughs> yeah, imagine it's like two people and they are riding like a a funny bicycle, <laughs> and then they they uh, they ride backwards into the river, and then they float there. These green and and uh, amber colored lights are so sexy. Now we have a failure. I think water got in. Shall we check how much it can carry water inside? Maybe. I would not make that experiment, I think. I think he is tired. He did too much. I was a bit mistreating my my poor newborn. Ah, now I can see the surface in the in the light. It's just felt with a very thin layer of latex, which has not yet completely dried. And now it's already part of a cruel experiment. enough. Do you want to say something? Camera is yours. Today was a, a day of, of sewing and painting at the neighbor's house and doing very effective research. Binding threads of history together.
there's a lot more work to do. Thank you. Thank you, dear viewers, to have the patience and the courage. Wow, look at look at this. I think it's the dirt in my lens which is copied over to every spot of light. These are the mysterious buildings of Kaiser Augusta Allee, 10553 Berlin. The mysterious dwellers, the mit mitbewohnerin who are not paying the rent. Yeah. They also don't rece receive the rent, although they are actually giving all the services. Mm. This is a car behind the trees. Okay. Love this green. Sexy. Green and reddish yellow. <laughs> Hello, Balti. I can't hey. wait to see you again. Balti. Woo. <laughs> we love you. We love you so You're much. You're so sexy. Sexy ass. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I, I film now. Don't lose the purple. This is the boat. Blurry. And this is the purple. Yeah, the purple at the moment is taking the show away from the boat. Center stage. And that's the sky. After sunset. But the boat brought us to the discovery of the purple. And we have a lens reflection here in the middle, in the middle top, do you we see? We have learned today that we do not need aerodynamic structures not to even, make Not even hydrodynamic. Yeah. And this red, wow. These three colors, classic. Yeah, we don't need aerodynamic. But I do like the almond shape of the canoe. I think it's it has great. its place in the so world. Nice, yeah. Next time we can shed more light on this invention. But today we work with circles and curach. And darkness. The inside is soft felt. Yes, but we will make we will make some research to produce some out of wool um, from local sheep of this region. <laughs> um, at the moment we may we experimented with industrial felt. And industrial latex. But we are seeking for providers of unwanted wool. Hello, creature. No, you are wearing a hat. Is it wet inside? Yeah, it's dripping on me. Okay. But it's not wet inside. It's very dry inside. It's really a turtle shell. And we will do some research to create tur Turing paddle patterns around our special turtle shell Yay. boat. And we will... Wow, it's reflecting the light here. We will get to know turtles a bit better. Yeah. Yeah, so as you can see in the video, 
dear viewer, it has kind of a a ragged surface, right? It's not it's not as smooth as we were expecting it to become. Yeah, latex is much more watery than I envisioned. I thought I would be making very much like a bi binary material with one layer of thick wool and one layer of thick latex but actually they blended somehow together and the latex seeped into every pore of the wool and made made the wool impermeable hmm. The dream would be if um, if Balti was here. The dream would be if Balti was here. If Balti was here, and also if we could make both from from latex turtle shells that humans could step into, so that they could cross the small river from one tent to the other. Yeah, let's do it. Someone is swimming. Human or duck? Okay, that's already 22 minutes and 39 seconds. Yeah, we went much over. We went so much over time. But it was really fruitful, huh? It was so fruitful. Our studio will fire it, but it will be. It will have been worth worth it. I think that um, Balti will be like exalted, no? <laughs> do, you yeah. she, do you think she will be happy to get material like this? Balti. Balti. We love you. <laughs>